was reviewing some content that I had produced for a course I'm holding in May at Streaming Media East in New York City. And this is one of the webinars I gave back in the January, February 2014 timeframe. And I was going to include some of this in the webinar. And then I noticed that the face is just clearly too dark. Not a good thing to have in an instructional video like that. So I'm thinking, do I want to download the video and adjust the face manually? Or is there something I can do in YouTube itself? And I saw this button here. And then I saw auto fix and I tried auto fix and that didn't do a lot. So I deselected that and then I boosted the fill light and I really don't know why YouTube starts playback every time I adjust something because that's not a really convenient thing to do. But it does have this nice interface where this is the original, again, clearly too dark. And this is the preview. Maybe you want to dial it down one notch. So here's the preview. Here's the original. And it's clearly much improved with very little work. And if I save this, YouTube will fix it for me. And then as they we say, I can go on and move to the next edit. I'm hoping that we're going to end up with a better result than what we started with. So I'm going to check out now and then wait for this to fix itself. And then we'll see what it looks like when the video is re-rendered and made available again. Okay, so this is the result. Overall, the exposure is much better. The face is brighter. And if I decided that it was too dark or too light, I could always go back into this panel and revert to the original. While we're here, let's take a look at, this is where I started, obviously too dark, and this is where I ended up. Could have gone maybe one more step, but that might have blanched the face a bit too much. Take a quick look at the other controls you can use over here. You've got saturation if your color is off, contrast, color temperature, slow motion. You can trim your video. I do that pretty frequently. You can also stabilize your video, apply these filters, which I almost never use, or apply a special effect where you blur the face. Anyway, if you've got video on YouTube where you don't like the look of the brightness or the exposure or any of these elements that you can correct with these controls, then you can use the controls on YouTube and fix them. I'm Jan Ozer. Thanks for watching.